everyone. It's Kelly with My Metamorphosis, and I have so missed you guys. Um, I am going to be doing a car haul with you this morning, and um, this is, you know, recent stuff from today that I purchased from the Dollar Tree, and um, as you know, I have other things that I purchased prior to haul for you, but right now I would like to just have a few moments with you guys, do a car haul. Um, I've got laundry to do today. If you can see back here, I've got two huge baskets of laundry to do. I am so behind. And I have got, I don't know how many bags of um, giveaway items. So, um, I am going to be dropping some things off to places that are open to take items um, to donate. And so I thought that I would just get on here with you guys and do a semi-small Dollar Tree haul. Um, grab a drink of your choice, grab a snack, sit back and relax, and please, please, please enjoy this Dollar Tree car haul with me this morning. Okay, I'm going to try to keep this um, phone mount from shaking all over the place. I've got my pink twisty wired one that I hauled from Shein. So, quick um, kind of update. Uh, I haven't heard anything yet from my ex-husband today on how my stepdaughter is doing, but um, it's been very touch and go with her. Um, and uh, she has had four surgeries from coming up from Texas. Um, I think I said she was at UW uh, when I talked with you guys about that. She's not. She's um, at Harborview in Seattle, and she um, has had to go back in and have um, three other surgeries, you know, in addition to her open heart surgery that she came up here for, um, to fix things. So, um, so yeah, not only are we praying that she stays safe from getting COVID while she's in the hospital, but also that she will heal well. And, um, my ex-husband is still over there with her and, you know, um, unfortunately COVID rules, he can't be in the hospital with her. Um, but, um, he is over there staying with a friend and he is, um, our line of communication with what's going on with our sweet Nicole. So continued prayers are so appreciated. Um, I am finally feeling better. Um, I was, I think when I watched my video back, my last video, I was saying that I was having some side effects and I didn't say of medication. That is what I meant. So I'm on new medications for the lupus. Um, I'm on um, an immunosuppressant they put you on, which is kind of confusing as to why they would want to suppress your immune system. But I guess with lupus, you your immune system is in overdrive. So, um, so that would explain why I was kind of having some hellish symptom or side effects for about a week. Um, I was um, overly tired because the medication was trying to fight what my body is trying to do. And um, also, I just had a horrible, horrible headache. So, um, I kind of just woke up one morning and I started to feel better. Like, my body is getting used to these meds. And so, I'm grateful and um, blessed to be able to sit here and say that to you. Um, I am on a steroid, which normally they wouldn't put me on a steroid unless I have a rash. I don't know if I mentioned this to you guys, but do you remember, did you see that video where I talked about how I ate those freeze dried strawberries from the Dollar Tree and I had, I broke out in a rash on my chest and I was confused. I was like, that's all I could really pinpoint it to. Um, I'm going to roll down my window a little bit because 
and this person's sitting in their car next to me. They probably think I'm totally nuts, but that's okay. Hopefully it won't be too loud. There is construction going on behind us. So, um, so, so yeah, um, I found out that that was actually a lupus rash. Um, so some rashes that I've gotten in the last however many years, um, that has, you know, I haven't, that I haven't been able to find an answer to, um, you know, as to what they were, that's what they are. So, um, normally they would only put me on a steroid, um, as a temporary relief of when I get a flare up like that. And, um, but they start you off on a steroid along with the immunosuppressant just to kind of kick everything into gear. So I'm, um, I have, uh, I'm retaining a lot of water. I'm very bloated and just, uh, but anyway, you guys, I'm here to do this car haul with you. Um, I have some exciting stuff to share with you and then some not so exciting stuff to share with you. So, um, let's go ahead and just jump on into this. I've missed you guys so very much. So I went to get laundry detergent, fabric softener, all that stuff. So I'm going to have to reach for a minute. I'm just going to pull one of these out. Well, we usually grab these. These are the fab. You get 40 fluid ounces and it says, um, I guess it doesn't say how many, <clears throat> excuse me, how many, um, loads you get but anyway it's 40 fluid ounces and um you know it's nice because it's name brand so i grabbed two of those and um then i grabbed two of i love it when they have the vanilla um of the suavitel um you get 11 it says 11 small loads of course it's however you use it you get 15.2 fluid ounces i grabbed two of those And let's just get this laundry stuff out of the way. And these, I think I'm going to put one of these in my car because it is making my car smell so good right now. So I love it when I find these. These are the extra large jumbo sheets. Um, you get 35 and it's the final touch. Again, and you know, name brand. They smell wonderful, you guys. Oh my gosh, they smell wonderful. And they are large. So just grabbed one of those and I'm just going to get through all the boring stuff first. As you know, I'm going to try the, um, sorry guys, excuse the reach. I'm going to try this, um, in wash fragrance booster today. This is in the spring. So I'll let you know how that works. Like I said, let's go ahead and just get through the boring stuff. So got a thing of the 25, whoops, 25 count Reynolds wrap foil sheets. Um, I grabbed one of these little five packs of five pack of the sure fresh um, clear with the green Tupperware um, these I'm not using for Tupperware I do not use the sure fresh for Tupperware I'll just say I don't know how anyone else feels about this but um, they are flimsy as far as I'm concerned so but I use these to store things so and one thing I'm going to put in here um, is um, our million and one quarters that I will be um, getting to purchase um, or to do laundry today. So, all right, let's see. I grabbed two more of these. I won't pull both of them out, but these are the Good Sense flap ties, the tall kitchen bags. Um, I like the vanilla the best, but the lemon is, is good too, and you get 14 bags. So grabbed two of those. And let me get these out of the way. And I used to put this in our washer when you know when we lived in our house with a washer and dryer. And I haven't used this since. And I thought I would try it again. It's the LA's Totally Awesome Power Oxygen Base Cleaner, and it's chlorine free, and you can use it in with your. Um, wash so it's um a good stain remover and this one has worked just fine for us even though it's you know just the the off brand not the oxyclean all right guys let's see what other boring stuff okay sorry i had to break into this this is just the 
the Greenbrier tissue, 175, and it's got it in this. I'm gonna leave this in the car. Grabbed a pack of pads to get a 10 count of the Modest. All right, I think, oh here, here's a couple more boring items. Um, I hadn't seen these in a long time and I grabbed two of them. Um, we have the three, the ones with the three outlets, but this one has, um, it's the big block with six outlets. It's called a wall tap. So I got two of those. And I think I've gotten through all of or most of the, um, the boring items. So, um, they've got some really, really cute decor out right now. I'm going to put this in our bathroom. It is, um, it matches our bathroom, kind of a beach theme and it's just, says I am with you always and it's Matthew 2820 it's just a little shadow box it's a nice small size um, I did end up getting a new water bottle I thought this was really cute <laughs> hold on one second you guys okay guys sorry about that one of my neighbors was coming in her boyfriend was waiting for her next to me that's who was probably thinking I was a total weirdo. Now she can explain that I have a YouTube channel to him. So um, yeah, I just told her that and she was like, oh my gosh, I didn't know that. So anyway, these are BPA free. I thought they were really cute. The pink top. So got one of those. You guys, I absolutely fell in love with these. Um, they're the little like window um, wall decor, window looking wall decor. This one says, welcome to our home. And it's kind of in this yellowish beige color. And I got the gray one. Our family gathers here. And the black one, home sweet home. And I just fell in love with these. They are so cute. I have no idea where I'm going to put them. I'm probably going to have to change out some stuff but I just really thought those were super cute I grab these when I see new um, prints and we have a lot of these and I just kind of put I use them throughout the house for different things so they're the little rugs you know they're not huge but I really liked this one it's got the black print kind of a flowery type print these are 15 by 21, so I grabbed two of those. Let me know how you guys are doing, okay, please. Let me know how everyone is doing. Are you, is anyone in Texas? Ooh, I'm shaking this thing all over the place, sorry. Anyone in Texas? Texas is, um, has opened up or is about to open up, so. Um, yeah, curious to know if any of you guys are from Texas. All right. And I'm on the lookout for another one of these. Um, the one with like the teal color, like the sea foam green color, but this is the black and white, the boho print. It says, I am with you. I love that. And it's got the little like picture frame type thing where you can set it up. Um, I knew I should have grabbed the green one when I saw it. So those are the two I wanted. Uh, I'm going to have to go to another Dollar Tree to get that. Um, I grabbed these two satin pillowcases for my boys. I just really liked the print. It's black and white. Sorry, that's kind of, there's a lot of glare. So I grabbed one for each of them. Um, I haven't found the good night one yet, but I did find the good morning satin pillow for my room and when I go to another Dollar Tree I will look for that okay here's one more boring item we needed some quart size um, Ziplocs you know name brand or whoops off brand Ziplocs so these are the Surefresh 
you get 12. Okay, sorry about that. I need to get, oh my gosh. Okay, sorry about that, you guys. I keep bumping this thing and I hope you're not gonna be getting seasick. Okay, so I need to roll my window down because, and I'm sorry about the glare, but it is really warm in here, so. Whoo, let me get some air up in here. All right, so, um, let's see here. Um, I had found the copper colored one, the pink and the purple, and I finally found the smoke color. Sorry about the glare, you guys. These are the liquid eyeshadows. You can see the color right there. It's like a smoky gray. Love that. All right, and I've got one more bag. Let me just pull these couple of Easter items out. We got some window clings. I thought these were so cute with the raccoon and the little camper and the fox and the bunnies. And look at the little hedgehogs, so cute. Um, so you get 14 pieces. And I've told you guys before that I always get one of these for every season and I don't think I have one for Easter. So this one is, they had two different ones. I liked this one the best. Bunny Hop, Jelly Beans, Easter Basket, Hoppy Easter, Easter Egg Hunt. Sorry guys, I only have so much room in here. Colored Eggs and Cottontail. I thought those were really cute. This one has the burlap in the background and this one has the faux burlap. So yeah. All right. Super excited to show you guys these. Here's another little shadow block box. This one is Grateful and Blessed. And I'm sorry if it's backwards. I'm not quite sure. Anyway. Um, so yeah, one of the little shadow boxes. Oh, and I grabbed some more Tylenol. I wanted to keep one in the car. Still getting a little, have a little bit of a headache. Nothing like it was. And then I thought these were so cute, you guys. They're the real wood and it's Bless This Nest. Of course, I, again, I just grabbed the ones I liked with the flowers and this pops out. And then this one that says home with the flowers and it, the home part pops out. It's got the little faux wood in the back. So they had another one. They had one that says, this is us, which I really like that saying, but I didn't care so much for the, um, the look of it. And then one that said thankful, which was cute. It had like a little, um, uh, ladybug on it but I just got those two and again I should have grabbed these when I saw them um, uh, the coffee one I believe I did grab and I don't know if I've hauled it yet I grabbed the one that is like the beach theme for our bathroom but I grabbed this one home sweet home with the birds and the eggs and the nest the flowers and I just thought this would be really cute for Easter and or spring got the galvanized metal so yeah, so I'm on the hunt for the coffee one. And then I saw two of these, but this is the one I liked. Um, and it's, if not now, when? And I just thought that this was absolutely so fitting for so many things in our lives right now. It's got the gold on the outside and it's like a shadow box. I just love that. And I love the little flower in the middle, sunflower. And then two more items. Um, these are like the little tiles with the wood, the real wood. So this one is blessed. I love this with the faux wood heart. Love the simplicity of that. And then this one just really, really spoke to my soul right now. And this one is trust your purpose. So again, you guys, I think for some reason this is all backwards and I apologize. So, so yeah, so there is my haul for today. And um, I was hoping that I was going to feel well enough to do um, a bunch of stuff while I was off of work because I was also having horrible dizzy spells from the medication. And um, 
uh, yeah, I drive for work, as you know, if you've been watching my videos. And so I was like, I'm not going to be driving when I'm feeling so dizzy and lightheaded. So, so anyway, I thought at least while I was home, I would be able to do some more uh, videos, but I just, I really needed to take it easy. And so, yeah, um, I'm just doing what I can and I am, um, you know, I have lots of content and I just, um, I will be getting it out um, little by little. Uh, please go check out my Instagram. I haven't done any cook with me videos yet, but I have been posting uh, meals that we've cooked and um, I will link that down below. It's my metamorphosis journey. Um, I love you guys so much and I appreciate every single one of you and everyone who reaches out to me. Um, I, you know, just to check in. I so appreciate that. You, there's really no words for that, um, how, how much I appreciate that. And so, um, so yeah, um, thank you guys. And, um, if you haven't subscribed already, please do so. I would love to have you be a part of this family and hit that like button. If you liked this video, don't forget to hit the notification bell so you can be notified every time I upload a video. And if you would please comment down below, I would so love to hear from you. Stay safe, stay blessed. Lots of love to you guys, and I will see you very soon. Bye.